Hey guys, Zuzu Natural here. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for joining me. If you are new, welcome. I make videos on clean, green skincare, beauty, health and wellness, and crystals. Today we're doing a skincare video. And so I will be reviewing melanin skin food. If you're interested in some skincare, stay tuned. <music> Okay, if you've been following me on this channel, you know I am a skincare junkie. Okay, I love clean, green skincare made with non-toxic, healthy, skin-loving ingredients. I think it is just game-changing when it comes to the feel, the look, and the healthiness of your skin. And so I'm all about it. I'm here for it. I'm here for it. So when melanin skin food... That's the back. When Melanin Skin Food, that's upside down. <laughs> when Melanin Skin Food reached out to me, I was like, yes, yes, yes. And so let me tell you a little bit about Melanin Skin Food before I go into the products. So Melanin Skin Food is a brand based out of South Africa. I love South Africa. It's one of my favorite countries in the entire world. Okay, Cape Town, have you been? Beautiful, stunning. Melanin Skin Food is based out of South Africa. And what the owner realized is that most of the quality and luxurious skincare products coming into South Africa and being sold in South Africa were being imported from the U.S. or from Europe. And then most of these products were not made with healthy skin loving and skin feeding ingredients and they definitely were not geared towards melanated skin. And so hence melanin skin food was born. So I love that idea. I love that concept. It's like, listen, if you make it, they will come. Like if you see something that needs to be created, if you see a void that needs to be filled in the green beauty community or any community that you're in, you do it. Don't look to everybody else to do it. You do it. I had the pleasure of trying four products from the skincare line. Uh, the Two skincare, actual skincare products I'll speak about were amazing. And I really want to tell you guys about those. And then I tried two lip care products. And I'll just talk about those very briefly at the end because they're lip care products. So the first two products that I want to tell you about are the Melanin Skin Food African Black Soap in the Melanin Skin Food Skin Glow Serum. So this is, they are sold separately. And separately, you'll pay $34.95 for both of them each, but together you can buy the set for $59.95. So you get more of a discount if you purchase it as a set. So now I know what you're thinking. You're like $34.95 for African Black Soap? I don't think so. Yes, yes, I think so. Let me tell you why. So when I first got the African black soap, I was like, oh, African black soap. Okay, I've used black soap on my skin. And I know people rave about black soap. But what I've found in the past is that with African black soap, it would kind of dry my skin out. Um, it just wasn't hydrating enough and it wasn't moisturizing enough. And for my body, fine. But for my face, no. Also very messy with the black soap all over the sink and all over the place. You have to have like a major cleanup afterwards. Not the case with this. So this is like African black soap 2019 right this is like like the updated version of african black soap and so i'm going to insert a clip of what it looks like because i've pretty much used it all i really just have like a little smush left <laughs> you know because it's soft and it melts it starts off as a hard bar but then it kind of melts and it's soft. So i have like a little smush left that i won't even bother showing you so let me tell you how it's different than regular black soap. And I'm going to go to their website and read a little something. So first of all, this is for all skin types. So it doesn't matter what kind of skin you have. Uh, I have normal with kind of a combination oily T-zone, but my skin is very normal, uh, especially in the cooler months. In the summer months, I can get a lot more oily in the T-zone, but I don't have oily skin anymore. I used to when I was in a different climate, but thank goodness I don't anymore. So the African black soap has been used for centuries to treat acne, eczema, psoriasis, dry skin, rashes, or just to purify. It also balances oily skin. So you can see how it can work for like all skin types and all skin conditions and problems. Uh, 
It foams into a rich brown lather, removing impurities without stripping the skin of its natural oils. And so that's where it differs. Like I said before, with black soap in the past, I found that my skin kind of dries out. And so I didn't really find it appropriate for my skin, which why I was a little weary at first when I got this one, because I was like, oh, I think it might dry out my skin. And I don't have dry skin. So I could just imagine if someone did have dry skin, it did not do that at all. So here's where it differs. This black soap has shea butter in it, which is great for treating acne and impurities. It has vitamins and minerals which fight free radicals and lock in moisture, heal, repair, strengthen the skin cells. It has tea tree oil which is anti-inflammatory. I love tea tree oil in my skincare. I absolutely love it. And then it has your traditional palm ash, tamarind extract, plantain peel which I believe is like the typical ingredients for a black soap and those are health promoting ingredients. And it's organic, it's fair trade, it's vegan, it's cruelty free, never tested on animals. And so I absolutely adore this soap. And so when you use it, like it lathers up so nicely and then it feels so hydrating as you're actually using it. So the very first time I used it, I was like, oh, this doesn't feel like black soap, traditional black soap at all. This isn't going to be drying at all because it's just moisturizing, feeling it soft and buttery, if that makes sense. Not buttery in a sense that it's oily or anything, but it's just very soft and hydrating and moisturizing. And you can tell it's actually feeding and hydrating your skin and making it more supple. So that was the very first step in the two-part system. And so that's the African Black Soap. I absolutely adore it. And I am now an African Black Soap fan, which I have never been in the past. Not for my skincare, like face, but for body, sure. But now I'm a fan for my face. Next, we have the Skin Glow Serum. Oh, this is beautiful. Oh, this is a beautiful, beautiful oil. So typically, I use this only in the evening. So I have normal skin with a kind of combination oily T-zone. But do you see my glow? Do you see my glow? That is this. Oh my gosh, my skin has been absolutely radiant this last month. And so many people have been like, oh my gosh, your skin looks so good. What do you use? And I'm like, this. I use this melanin skin food. So this is a beautiful, beautiful oil. And let me just go to their website so I can tell you what's in it so I don't miss anything out. So they say it's for problematic and dry skin. I don't have either of those. I will say I have sensitive skin. And so I do have to pay attention to the ingredients that I use because if it's some sort of toxic ingredient or some sort of ingredient that'll like um, smother the skin, it, it'll just give break me all out. So I do have to be careful. But this serum contains rich, powerful oils for intense hydration and it really does when you put this on in the evening and I put it on at the end of my skincare so after I've washed my face after I've toned my face I go ahead I put my eye serum on and then I put my oil on and I do it when my skin is still kind of damp not wet but damp and it just locks everything in it feels so good if you have um, dry skin you're gonna adore this if you have normally normal skin you're gonna love this if you have oily skin I'm not Sure, because it really is a hydrating, moisturizing formula. And just because you have oily skin doesn't mean your skin is hydrated. That's for sure. You can have oily, dehydrated skin. So just test it out if you have oily skin. Okay, so it is made with rose hip oil. It is made with marula oil, jojoba oil, vitamin E, lemongrass, and tea tree. And let me tell you, that lemongrass and that tea tree smells so good when I put this on I'm just smelling it like oh my gosh this smells so nice so it comes with this glass dropper and I'll just go ahead and just give you a little drop little little drop right there look at that look at that and so I'll just rub that in so you can see oh you see look at the glow look at the glow on my hand my hand is it smells it's like invigorating. The smell is inv invigorating. That tea tree, oh my goodness. And oh, that tea tree is so amazing. And lemongrass, oh, love the smell of lemongrass. And so now I'm going to be sniffing my hand. But um, yeah, so that's that's the, the skin serum 
And it says daily use will result in clearer and healthier skin, what works best in combination with our African black soap, which is what I have been using it for the last month now in combination. And um, I'm almost out of the soap, so I either need to get some more or I'll just use it on its own. But it is really beautiful. And so I wanted to come on and share those two products with you. They also have two lip products, a lip smoothie, and then they have a lip scrub. And I haven't really used the lip scrub much because we are coming out of summer, moving into fall now, the very beginning of fall, my lips haven't been dry. So I used it once and it's a sugar scrub that feels good with getting sloughing off the dry skin off of your lips. But the lip smoothie I use, I put it under my pillow. So I don't know if you guys are like me. I have lip balms everywhere. I have like a purse lip balm. I have a uh, pocket lip balm. I have an under the pillow lip balm. And so this one is the one I put under my pillow. So when my lips are dry in my sleep, I'm just like reaching around blind for it, putting it on. And it feels so good. It's very hydrating and moisturizing on the lips and um, keeps my lips feeling soft and supple. And so... We're in the beginning of fall and my lips feel good. And so if I go ahead and use the lip scrub a little more, I'll talk about it in another video, maybe like a skincare routine. I'll show you that. And so this is the Melanin Skin Food line. Loving it. So excited that they sent it to me. Uh, this video is sponsored, but all thoughts and opinions are my own. Absolutely my own. And I love that African Black Soap and I love that skin serum. And the, the lip smoothie is, it's nice. It's nice. It's a nice product um and so and then a lip scrub like i said it's a lip scrub i've only used it once can't really attest to that but that's the melanin skin food have you tried it oh my gosh do you love it drop it in the comments let me know uh, if you have any questions about any of the products that I mentioned, go ahead and drop those in the comments and I'll do my best to answer them. And so that is our skincare review uh, for today. Um, I'm going to do a lot more skincare reviews because I just love skincare. I'm a skincare junkie. Okay. So let me know if there's anything you want me to review in the comments. Drop that. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Zuzu Natural. Peace out.